Welcome to this DSM TV special, in which we celebrate 100 years of vitamins and hear about DSM's nonprofit humanitarian initiative called Sight and Life. Enjoy the show. It was 1912, a hundred years ago, when a Polish American biochemist, Casimir Funk, discovered a bioactive in rice brands that counteracted beriberi disease, and he called it vitamin. After his landmark publication, a lot of scientists entered the field and discovered another 13 vitamins. The discovery that there are essential bioactives, which are essential for nutrition, for healthy nutrition, inspired our company to develop synthetic roots for these products. So it was us that uh, we developed the first uh, production process for vitamin C. This was in 1934. The discovery of vitamins has proven key to human health. We are right now the market leader in the field, vitamins for human nutrition, animal nutrition and personal care. Most vitamins cannot be directly produced by the body and therefore a balanced and varied diet is essential. However, in the developed world of abundant and modern lifestyles with increasing unhealthy food consumption, inadequate vitamin intakes are surprisingly common. Vitamins also help to improve animal nutrition and thus enhance the quality of food that is produced from them. And for our broader well-being, vitamins are also being widely used in skin, sun, and hair care products. In more recent years, DSM also began to focus on the developing countries where people do not have access to vitamin-rich foods, and this leads to high mortality rates and serious health problems. To help close up the gaps in essential micronutrient intakes, DSM works in close partnership with organizations such as the World Food Program and the International Osteoporosis Foundation. 100 years vitamins and uh, the history did not or does not end. There's a lot of publications about new science on vitamins and we are heavily engaged in this. Vitamins are now officially 100 years old, but their story has just begun. This year, we also celebrate the 25th anniversary of Sight and Life, the nonprofit humanitarian initiative and well-respected think tank of DSM. Sight and Life started in 1986 during a humanitarian crisis in Ethiopia, providing vitamin A capsules for the prevention of blindness and death among the victims. What Sight and Life has been able is to bring about a consensus around the importance of malnutrition, particularly on children in early stage of life, the first thousand days, and the critical importance to doing something about it to alleviate the uh, scourge of uh, hidden hunger, particularly for the young age. Micronutrients, Macro Impact is the new book that Sight and Life launched to mark this anniversary. It is a story about vitamins in a hungry world, published at a time when two billion people worldwide are suffering from micronutrient malnutrition. These people are facing the physical, social, and economic impact from malnutrition. The book really makes a very compelling reading, and it kind of puts the burden of knowledge on us. And it is important now to share that knowledge to really compel action on a much, much broader basis than is already the case today. Hidden hunger is something that can be eradicated, that can be eradicated in our lifetime, and the sooner the better. Order your own copy of the book at sightandlife.org. Well, that wraps up our special edition of DSM TV to mark 100 years of vitamins. To learn more, visit 100yearsofvitamins.com. Thanks for watching.